Well, I thought I had a little bit of a gas leak on my gas furnace package unit. See a little bit of bubbles there. Everything else right here. Got a little bit right there. As I come on into the uh, panel where the gas valve is, you can see the bubbles right there. All right, we've got a little bit of a gas leak there more than the other. And uh, we're gonna clean it up a little bit. She fired up pretty good just a minute ago, flame and all. It was good. I'll show you, hold on a second. All right, you see here I've put a uh, jumper wire on the W on the circuit board, the white. If you come right here to the red, I don't know if you can see it, but I'm gonna jump it and you should hear it start. There we go. That basically jumped the thermostat so that the uh, inducer motor starts running its cycle. Uh, you can see the little red lights on right there from it's blinking, all right, and then it'll light up here in just a second. The diesel fan's blowing properly. Uh, you should see a glow, the hot surface igniter here in a moment. Uh, then you get it on. There it is. Hold on just a second. Let me get it on there, good. That's got the problem. I didn't have a good connection. Put it right in there on the terminal itself. Now, we should do it. done was use some Dawn dishwashing detergent and put around where the connections are. This unit has been in uh, close to 15 years and uh, hopefully I can get one more season out. I checked the heat exchanger a little while ago and uh, it didn't have any uh, holes or anything that I could tell from the inspection. Had a little bit of rust. It's going to have that for moisture. Take your uh, jumpers off. It'll cut off in just a moment when the limit switch. Flame already shut off. The limit switch is um, once it cools down inside there, it'll it'll shut the uh, fan off or the inducer off, and then the fan will run just for another moment. You can still hear the fan running, and then that switch in there will shut off once it gets warm enough or cool enough, should I say? Not too bad. This is a Nordine unit, right at 15 years old. A uh, little rust here and there, but other than that, it's pretty good. It's been, been a good unit. I've uh, replaced the condenser fan motor on it this past summer. 
it had a leak generated the year before in the um, evaporator coil where the um, tubing was coming through the metal around the elbows or whatever and the guy repaired that for me and uh, saved me a good bit but it's not a bad unit